Welcome to Easy Elim, Learning Simplified. My name is Ruth and today we are going to be learning from two mathematics and our topic for today is statistics. And today we are going to look at a few problems of group data. So previously we looked at calculation of mode, median and mean of group data. So let's see some of like questions, how the questions in statistics one usually come and then you solve a few, maybe two or three questions, and then you'll get an opportunity to practice more uh, in the app. So, for example, the table below shows marks scored by 140 candidates in a test. So you're supposed to calculate the mean mark, calculate the median mark, and set the model class. So you see these are three concepts that we have learned for the last three uh, topics. So let's calculate the mean. Remember we said the formula for calculating mean, it has to be sum of fx over sum of f. So max number of candidates. Number of candidates in this case will be f. So we need to get the value of x. I'm going to introduce another column here on top. So this column will be, we are going to add the classes or uh, boundaries. So we are going to add 1 plus 10, which will give us 11. So 11 divided by 2 will give us 5.5. And then 11 plus 20 will give us 31, which if you divide by 2 will give us 15.5. And then 21 plus 30 will give us the 51. If you divide that by 2, you will get 22, 25.5. And then 31 plus 40 will give us 71. If you divide that by 2, you will get 35.5. And finally, 50 plus 41 will give us 91. If you divide that by 2, you will get 45.5. So we need to get the value of fx. Let me introduce another column here of fx. So fx will be the x times f. So 5.5 uh, times 8 is going to give us 44. And 15.5 uh, times 23 is going to give us 356.5. And then 25.5 multiplied by 55 will give us 1000. 402.5 and then 35.5 uh, 35.5 times 36 will give us 1278 and then finally 45.5 uh, times 18 will give us 818. So we need to get the sum of f. So the sum of f is 8 plus uh, 23 plus 55 plus 36 um, plus 18, which will give us 140. And then sum of fx will be 44 plus 356.5 plus 1402.5 plus 1,278, plus 818, which will give us 3,899. So we need to look for sum of fx over one, sum of f. So 3,899 divided by 140 is going to give us 27.85. So that is the mean mark uh, for the student. And you can see even our values, most of the highest percent of students uh, got between 21 and 30 marks. So you can imagine the mean average will majorly range here because more than a half of the students uh, have, have 21 or 30 and below. And we calculate the second question, calculate the median mark. The median mark, remember the formula, you calculate the lower limit plus the total, total frequency 
over 2 minus the cumulative frequency of the preceding class over frequency of the median uh, class and then times the width that is when you subtract the upper limit from the lower limit and we will call it height so the lower limit of the total frequency is 140 so remember 140 is an even number so we are going to divide this by 2 which is going to give us 70 So it's supposed to be the 70th and 71st uh, number. So we need to get that from the cumulative frequency. So when you look at the first class, when you cumulatively calculate, this is going to be 8. And then 8 plus 23 uh, will give us 31. So this is 31. When we cumulatively do the second class, it will be 31 plus 55 which will give us 86 so that tells you from 31 to 86 it means our median value is supposed to be in the class of 21 to 30 so let's let's keep that in mind so the low lower limit for this class is going to be 20.5 plus n is 140 divided by 2 minus cumulative frequency of the preceding class which is 11 to 20 is 31 remember we had done that you divide it by the frequency of the median mark so the the median class is 21 to 30 the frequency for that is 55 and then times the um the width and the width you get it by calculating 30.5 that is the upper class minus the lower class of so that median class minus 20.5 which will give us 10 so times 10 so this becomes 140 divided by 2 is 70 70 minus 31 gives us 39 so this becomes 20.5 plus 39 over 55 times 10 so this is the same as 20.5 plus so 39 divided by 55 will give us 0 0.7090 then times 10 it will be 7.091 so if we add this to 20.5 it's going to be 27.591 so 27.591 is the median mark and you can see it is in the median class of 21 to 30 and then finally the last uh, question calculates the model class so model class is specifically the one that is repeating itself uh, or has the highest frequency so you pick the class that has the highest frequency and the one that has the highest frequency is the one that has 55. So the model class is the, the model class is going to be 21 to that. So I hope you've seen how we have calculated. This helps us to recap uh, the calculations or the work that we did in the previous lessons. So let's look at one final question and then you can do the rest of the questions provided in the app. So you have been given the, the values of uh, marks obtained by 40 candidates. So we know that total number of candidates are 40. So you have been given the classes and the frequency. So if we add up the frequency cumulatively, we have 2 plus 12 plus 7 plus 15. It's supposed to add up to 40, but up to this point is 36. Meaning, if we add the value of x plus 36, we should get 40. So it means the final value is going to be 4. Because 36, 40 minus 36 is equals to 4. So that's how we get the value of x. And then calculate the mean mark. That means we need the value of x and we need also fx. So we will get the value of x by adding 5, uh, 5 plus 14. 
which will give us 19. If you divide by 2, you get 9.5. Remember, x is the midpoint, so 9.5. And then to get the next one, it's going to be 15 plus 29, which will give us 44. If you divide by 2, you're going to get 22. And then the next will be 30 plus 34, which will give us 64. 64 divided by 2 will give us 32. And then 35 plus 44, which will give us 79, divided by 2 will give us 39.5. And finally, 45 plus 49 will give us 94. If you divide by 2, you get 47. So if you were to calculate fx, it will be 9.5 times 2, which will give us 19. And then 12 times 22, which will give us 264. And then 7 times 32, which will give us 224. And 15 times 39.5, which will give us 592.5 and finally 47 times 4 which will give us 188. So the sum of the frequencies we know it's 40 because you've already been told we are dealing with 40 uh, candidates and then the sum of fx will be 19 plus 264 plus 224 plus 592.5 plus 188, which will give us 1,287.5. So the formula is sum of fx over sum of f. fx is going to be 1,287.5 divided by 40. So this is going to give us 32. So that's how you solve that question. You notice the classes are not uh, equal throughout. So getting the median and the mode, the median that is, will require a different formula than what we discussed. You're going to do that later on in statistics too. So a check out for more revision questions in the app and also notes in the app on how the statistics one questions are usually asked and practice how to answer those questions. So see you in the next lesson.